Wheat is a brilliant particle for pre-baiting. Watch the rest of this video to see how I prepare it. Here's a bag I bought yesterday, £5.30 for a 20 kilogram bag. Excellent value for money. Really, really simple how to prepare it. Loads of different ways. Watch the rest of the video and I'll show you how I do it. Step number one, take out what you need, put it in your bucket, let it soak. Here's the wheat. It's been soaking now for three or four days. And if I scoop a bit out, you'll see it's probably twice the size of its dry state. So I've got enough in there. Take back into the house. Wheat must be one of the easiest particles to prepare. So I've had this batch soaking outside for probably four days. I've brought it inside and there are so many ways of doing the next part. For me, the quickest way is I'm just gonna put the wheat into a pan. I've probably got the same amount of wheat to the same amount of water. I'm gonna literally bring it to the boil and then I'm gonna transfer it to a bucket. So here we go. Let's get the wheat into the pan. Get this going we're going to bring it to the boil and like i said put it into an airtight bucket particles need to prepare to avoid any fish damage the problem is that when we boil particles we change its molecular structure and its nutritional value therefore the less boiling time the better one way to help this is to soak the particles for longer you can see why i've soaked the wheat now for four days outside it will need less boiling time to get it prepared I've brought the pan to the boil, and now what I'm going to do without scolding myself is transfer the whole lot into this bucket. I'm just going to put this lid on, nice airtight lid, and I'm going to leave this bucket for at least 24 hours. This is the secret with wheat. If you can leave it for a long time, 24 hours, 48 hours, the wheat will start to caramelise in its own juices and it has a really nice nutty smell and I'm absolutely convinced fish like carp, tench, they actually start to seek the wheat out. So, the longer you can leave this, <laughs> within reason, the better. We've had the wheat sitting for probably about an hour. Ideally you'd leave it for 24 hours but let's just have a look to see what it's like. That looks pretty good. You can see it's probably swollen already, probably twice its size, and it's really soft. So tench, carp, they all bream, <laughs> they all love chewing on this stuff. So really cheap pre-bait, wheat, and that is how to prepare it. Really, really straightforward.